So today, which at the time this is recording would be May 24, 2021, I would like to do some battles with my birds Beyblades because yesterday I spent that day where I did two videos. One was where I was unboxing a bunch of Metal Fight Beyblades from that time where I didn't get to the rest of them because I was too worried about assembling them too poorly. But then I realized that later that they had instruction booklets and as well as watching some videos online that assembling them wasn't actually too bad. So I spent that video, which I believe was 30, 35 to 40 minutes long, just assembling them. Then after that, I made a separate video where I just battled them and I had lots of fun. And on that same day, I did also experiment with these to also get better with launching them. And the verdict is that honestly, I think this Fafnir is rather problematic in that it was the only one that just didn't seem to want to speak to any of my launchers for the life of it. I watched some of the videos yesterday and people were launching theirs just fine. So I don't know if it's just me or I don't know if it's just these launchers I have there that are problematic. But either way, it's just going to have to be mostly battles between these three because this one, who knows, maybe it's a behave on camera. But if not, I'm not going to even bother wasting my time because based on the experience yesterday, it was just being way too difficult and uncooperative, so it's not something that I'm really going to be doing. Unless I'm just going to be hand spinning it maybe, but you can only hand spin so fast, like, really, before it just does something like that. So, case in point, you know, let me sit down while I do this. It feels kind of loose this one, and that's kind of the way this one is, it always feels somewhat loose. Okay, so I didn't launch that too good, but you know what? I want to just leave it there as a distraction while I put this metal piece, no, not metal, <laughs> plastic, in front of my computer, because if you saw the video yesterday with the Metal Fight Beyblades, these things can get very violent. Like, when I say violent, I mean violent. Like, they were jumping out of the stadium, they were just doing all manner of violent battle top things. Like, you know how battle tops are. So obviously battle tops, and they can bounce quite a bit. The first ones, I'm not sure if they're that bouncy, but like when the metal ones, oh my gosh, man, the way those things bounce is just whoa, like whoa. Anyways, so let's see if I can get this to cooperate. Hopefully it doesn't act dumb on camera because if it does, then that would be a pain. Just be me just spinning them individually then, but I don't think it should be like that. See, that was a good launch right there. So now let's let this one go in. And it just knocks this Pegasus right out. Okay, that didn't take very long. Now I don't know if I should relaunch, actually, not if that should relaunch because it won't be fair to it. Is it even in frame? Almost. Okay, there we go. Now it's in frame. Should try and launch this the other one as soon as possible. I know I made a boo boo there. Yeah, it looks like the burst ones don't bounce as much. I don't know if it's because of their weight, but yeah. You know, I think it has to do with the weight. Because the burst B blades are obviously way bigger. And I think they're also way heavier too, naturally. So you're not going to see them bouncing and jumping like these agile squirrels. Actually, no, I'm going to use this one again. Well, actually, no, 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 I'll use this red one. And then I'll use this one. Now, yesterday, I was reasoning with myself, and I was like, if the Burst Beyblades use plastic, the top and the metal ones use metal that it seems like metal fight ones would just last longer over the next 10 years like for babies like this where their construction is mostly plastic especially since they're making contact with the plastic 
I don't see them as things that would last very long. Like, I know the plastic feels very tough and durable, of course, but in comparison to a Mesa Beyblade where it's actually metal, where they're fighting, it just seems like it would last way longer. I, I, I just could not imagine something like this lasting 10 years, especially if it's going to be fighting all the time. Which is why some people buy multiples of the same blade, Beyblade, so they can have one for battling, one for collection purposes, and then another for... Where did I put my laundry now? You know, I don't know, so I'm just going to have to use this purple one. I think this one was the last time anyway, so I'll have this one going first this time. <laughs> but that didn't go very well, so... i have to try and find that, and... Well, actually, I think for the meantime, I need to get that thing together, and I'll be back. Okay, super silly me, it was right here. I don't know why I didn't notice that, but I see it now, so... Gonna hope that this launch is properly, not stupidly. Alright, that's a very healthy launch. This one does very poor stamina. It just does not last, it just doesn't. Like I bet I could throw this one in here and it would still probably beat it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, please, I'm, I'm gonna make that bet. I know that's a very ambitious thing to say. Okay, maybe that was too ambitious. Let's do this fairly and let's just. Uh, do I want this one to spin first or do I want that one to spin first? No, I think I'll make this one spin first. Yes, I know. Very limited collection, but it is what it is. It'll get bigger over time. Really wish I could launch my Fafnir, but. He doesn't want to cooperate. Alright, so in the meantime, I'll just let that spin and attempt to get my Fafnir on one of these launchers, but I'm not going to have high expectations because it's very weird and funny like that, so... Nope, not sticking to this one. Not sticking to this one either. Uh, nope. Wait, I'll try the string launcher. I sometimes had luck with that. Again, nope. Okay, I guess it just doesn't want to do that. And on top of that, it's coming apart now. You know, I think I should just not even bother trying to get this thing to launch. But then again, it just feels so repetitive to just be using only these three for the whole video, but yeah, whatever. It would be so nice to just have this one battling, but it doesn't like any of my launchers. Oh yeah, I can try launching to the side. The only problem with that though is it doesn't want to stick there either. Ugh, okay. Maybe I'll do this one. Maybe I'll do it like this. Nope. Actually, you know what? Okay, while I'm attempting to do that, I'm just gonna set up another battle that makes sense. Rather than have me fiddle in the background and nothing exciting happens. That's... No, I can't do that. Instead, we'll have these two duke it out. Okay, that was a very poor launch. You know, maybe I should throw some Meta Fight Blades in here just to make it nasty now. I want to keep this video pure burst. And then in another video later, I'll mix the generations. That's the sound of my Nokia Lumia 1520 in the background telling me that it needs to be charged. For those that have never owned a Windows phone. If you don't know what sound I'm talking about, I was talking about that piano sound. Terrible launch, but whatever. I wasn't paying attention to who stopped, though when I actually looked at, down at the stadium, it looks like it was this one that stopped first and this one stopped after, of course, which should hardly be a surprise. Uh, hmm, I guess I'll do red and blue again. Oh, 
that was a horrible launch. A horrible launch again. All right. Um, yeah, let me just try this red one again because I think it fared a bit better with it. Yes, yes, it likes the red one. I really want this Fafnir to be in this video, so if you even have the hand spin it, so be it. But it keeps coming apart! Ugh! And I can't throw it at the wall either, because then I would do some serious damage. You know what? Forget you. Uh, maybe I should just call it quits? Or should I keep going? No, you know, it's too repetitive. You see, if I had more burst Beyblades to toy around with, it would have been great. But because I do not, actually, wait, do I have another one in this box? Let's see, which box am I talking about? This, of course. So yes, I guess actually I'll just call it quits because I can't get this guy to work. If I could, that would have been fantastic. It would have been a much more variable battle. But because I cannot, it's just gonna have to be boring. Out.